you are watching mentor english professor m a raza we have lot of other electronic channels for the betterment of society for example phalia tv1 mentor english mentor urdu mentor turkish mentor uh, arabic and uh, jami darloom shakul islam so must subscribe and hit the bell icon to all thanks my online family i love you all welcome back everyone hope you will be fine in the high state of belief and health from mentor english uh, myself motivational speaker leadership business coach master trainer language trainer vlogger novelist professor amir raza today the topic is uh, pioneers uh, pioneer english novelists the english novel as literary genre saw a new heights uh, during the 18th century this this rise and development was the result of many factors we discussed in the above sections the present uh, the uh, present section or in my uh, previous lectures you can uh, easily uh, digest all these uh, particular information uh, is uh, uh, dedicated to highlight the pioneer english novelist from the century of uh, your understanding uh, of their contribution and artwork uh, and their uh, work number 1 daniel defew 1659 to 17 1731 daniel defew was born in london in 1659 the son of a butcher uh, he uh, later established as a merchant a public official a manufacturer and an editor before he became a successful writer at later age when he was 58 he introduced among other things the journalists uh, the journalistic first person narrative method transforming fiction to be a realistic writing to the readers daffu was the first english writer who introduced the techniques of realism in the novel he contributed a total of 250 works but is uh, but is best known for his uh, uh, mall flanders uh, robinson crusoe and a journal of uh, the plague year 1722 for his uh, uh, versimile uh, similitude uh, he is considered as one of the father of the modern novel defus uh, robinson crusoe is uh, sometimes considered as the first model, modern novel it was the story of robinson uh, robinson crusoe an imaginary character with the style of first persons uh, na- narration uh, narration method which introduced the element of realism in english novel uh, interestingly the novel did not have any real plot but it was just an account of a chronological series of events however as discussed earlier some critics categorized this work as a heroic romance uh, for the elements of uh, crime and adventure crime and adventure in the story in the story even uh, if uh, this opinion is true many later novelists uh, were greatly inspired by defus style his realism and the autobiographical elements in fiction samuel uh, samuel richardson 1689 to 1761 uh, another pioneer english novelist uh, samuel richardson was born in 1689 in london uh, derbyshire he uh, derbyshire and warwickshire uh, uh, if you know about uh, uh, importance of being earnest by oscar wilde so that is also in the person in the person and places in the places of uh, uh, ernest uh, uh, importance of being earnest there are available these two important uh, uh, counties or communi- uh, counties and uh, uh, the derbyshire county and the warwickshire county he initially operated as an expert printer and published the journals of uh, the house of commons and also worked as the law printer to the king in his early age he had an uh, he had an ample experience of uh, writing love letters for uh, uh, for at least uh, three girls through these letters uh, he greatly understood uh, various ways of uh, femininity and uh, subsequent subsequently utilized them uh, while writing in his uh, uh, epistolary style novel such as in 
Pamela, uh, such as in such as in Pamela or virtue rewarded as an author, Richard uh, Richardson was of the view that the writer always had two purposes of writing: uh, first, uh, to inform the readers, and second, and second, uh, second rewarded, second to promote uh, uh, morality. The whole story of the novel Pamela, also known as Virtues, uh, as Virtue uh, Rewarded, is based uh, on morality and is uh, the is uh, in the form of uh, exchange. Here is a uh, composing mistake, and uh, is in the form of uh, uh, the exchange of uh, personal letters uh, written by the girl Pamela to her parents. Richardson is uh, well known for two things in the history of the novel. He initiated and popularized the, uh, the epistolary style of story writing and he introduced and popularized the features, <coughs> the features of realism and uh, sentimental, uh, sentimentality in English novel Pamela, who is also the narrator of uh, uh, the story, is a servant girl employed by a rich land uh, owner who informs her parents about uh, maintaining of her uh, of her virtue against the uh, inappropriate advances of her employer until he finally sends her a marriage her a marriage proposal the whole story is told in the form of letters samuel richardson is is uh, accredited accredited to have uh, initiated the novel of character by discovering and exploring the uh, emotional and psychological growth in Pamela. The history Sir Charles uh, Grandson and Clarissa or the history of a young lady were additional novel written in the same epistolary uh, style by Richardson. Henry Fielding 1707 to 1750 Four. Henry Fielding, also known as the father of English novel, was born in 1707 at uh, Sharpham Park near uh, Glastonbury. Uh, he was uh, well educated and also uh, studied law. Uh, initially, he was influenced by the Spanish uh, picaresque tradition of uh, fiction writing. He is uh, well known for his uh, great novel such as uh, Tom Jones 1742 uh, Shamila and Joseph Andrews 1749 he popularized the aspects of characterization realism and craftsmanship in the novel in the novel uh, through his novels uh, Fielding presented a realism and a, a true picture of uh, human nature. His first novel was uh, Shamila, uh, which uh, you can also say it Shamila, which he wrote as a, a parody uh, to pa Pamela by Richardson for considered uh, it to be uh, hypocritical uh, in morality while writing it. Uh, he uh, popularized comic novels. Uh, he continued to mock at Richardson's Pamela, giving a contrast of situation with Joseph as a young man being uh, constantly followed by a followed by a, a wealthy woman in his popular novel. Joseph Andrew Henry Fielding, uh, therefore, is supposed to have laid the foundation for comic novels you will study his novel joseph andrew in details in your unit 3 uh, Lawrence Saturn, 1713 to 1768, born in 1713 in Ireland. Lawrence Saturn was well known for his unique style of writing. As a pioneer, as a pioneer novelist, he was well educated, who com who completed his education from Cambridge and got appointed as a priest. Very different and unique in his uh, in his. In his approach, uh, Saturn wrote very differently as uh, compared to other novelists of uh, the time. He, su he successfully time he successfully experimented with the novel for writing in uh, different ways, avoiding the uh, 
uh, avoiding the conventional uh, methods of writing with the opening middle and ending of the story his uh, his uh, his uh, he was certainly a different uh, uh, his work was certainly a different here is another composing mistake certainly a different and unique style among the major novelist of uh, his time Saturn's novel Life and uh, Opinions of uh, Tristram Shandy, Gentleman, 1759 to 1767, was first published in nine volumes. Saturn employed his new autobiographical and non uh, autobiographical and uh, biographical and non linear techniques in his novel. The unique style of Stern includes frequently uh, skipping uh, parts and jumping ahead of time shifting back in time and creating and creating uh, and creating uh, fragment uh, fragmented narrations the main uh, character of uh, the main character of the story uh, Tristram uh, Shandy is introduced only in volume uh, 4 of the novel unlike his uh, uh, contemporaries who had a definite plot structure with the uh, proper beginning middle and ending uh, Saturn's novel Saturn's novel had no such things uh, as no de uh, no definite plot instead the story begins in the middle in the middle had no such things as uh, no definite plot instead the story begins in the middle then uh, get uh, constantly inter uh, intercepted with uh, devices such as humorous re uh, reflections, uh, reflections, digressions, and deliberate blank uh, pages uh, purposefully kept in the middle of the story, progression by uh, sensory su uh, suggestions and uh, momentary re uh, reactions to immediate experiences. His uh, his style greatly influenced modern writers such as Virginia Woolf and James Joyce, who use uh, the who use the stream consciousness stream of consciousness as narrative techniques in their novel. Other important novelist, uh, another uh, unique novelist, Jonathan Swift, sixteen sixty seven to seventeen forty five, was known for his uh, allegory and style. Gulliver's Travels, seventeen twenty six, and A Tale of uh, a Tub, uh, seventeen zero four. Uh, some uh, uh, some uh, teachers uh, use the word tub as tube, so I'm not uh, agreed with that. With that. A Tale of Tub, according to my opinion, according to my best knowledge. 1704, where his uh, popular, uh, popular lyrical novel, he introduced writing the story of fantasy, uh, fantasy as a sterical work to, uh, to reveal shortcomings and weaknesses found in the English society through his novels. Among uh, other English novelists, from the 18th century, Tobias uh, uh, Simulit, 1721 to 1771, was an uh, influential writer. He was well known for his hysterical work and for describing familiar scenes, fo uh, foibles, and follies from everyday life. He mainly used uh, picaresque style in his uh, novel and uh, such a uh, Gilbus, uh, such as Gilbus, uh, 1715 to 1735, and The Adventures of uh, uh, Rudrick uh, Random, 1748. And the next topic we will definitely uh, discuss. And uh, my dear students, the next topic is uh, uh, post 18th century novelists. So we will uh, discuss in uh, uh, our next. Uh, uh, topic and as a next lecture so uh, before going i would like to request you that if you uh, any one of you uh, from your family or your surrounding uh, searching novel as uh, from uh, in urdu language then must ask him that uh, subscribe subscribe uh, mentor urdu murshur urdu and uh, subscribe mentor english and if you are searching for Islamic or Diniyat lectures, must subscribe Jame Darlum Shakul Islam. And uh, for uh, children's, uh, any uh, children, 
any child from the your from your surrounding is uh, addicted from youtube shorts then our channel will help you uh, monastery club takhlikat uh, almi atfal so must subscribe and hit the bell icon let me go now and say with me do something more for humanity do something more for knowledge and practices have a good day